No, Marcella, we haven't received any information yet, but I am standing here on Pepper Drive where the first responders are at the scene. They're just up the street behind me. They actually just asked us to move further down. Not really sure why, but they did ask us to uh, move out of the area now. We haven't uh, confirmed, as I just said, whether or not anyone's been injured, if any homes were damaged. And I want you to take a look at some of the cell phone video that we have just moments after the plane crash. You can uh, see flames and debris from the plane in the street. There's also people walking around just trying to find out what happened. You know, this area of Pepper Drive between 1st and 2nd Street has been blocked off. Now, we were able to talk to a few people off camera, and they told us that they were just at home you know, doing what they normally do when they heard a loud noise, a loud boom. Uh, it started shaking. Their home started shaking. Their lights went out. Um, they ran outside and they could just see a big ball of fire. Now, San Diego Gas and Electric has confirmed that they are here waiting to restore the power, but they're not able to get into the area, and they won't be able to do that until they get the clearance from first responders to uh, go ahead and enter. So if you want information about the power outage, you can go to CBS8.com and click the Help button. You'll find a link there to keep you updated on the outages, and we hope to bring you more information, if we can get some, tonight at CBS8.com. Uh, dot com. Thank you.